Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So this morning I'm going to be getting crew ready to come with me on an outing today as we prepare for his big sister. So he's sleeping next to me currently but it is time to get him ready for the day so we can head out as early as possible because it's always easier to go early and I feel like I've got the shops to myself which is nice. So I'm getting everything out that we need. Um, I need to change his nappy, get him dressed and all of that fun stuff. So that's currently what I'm getting ready for in this clip. So after a quick nappy change, I am going to put him straight into his clothes uh, after I've given him his bottle. So if you want me to make a video on how I make this fake milk, please let me know in the comments below and I'll happily do that. And then I'm just going to keep him wrapped up in his muslin while I feed him. Obviously, I've got to burp him and make sure all that winds up so we can now get him dressed and then get him straight into his car seat, get myself ready and we can leave. So here he is getting put in this really nice striped sleeper with a matching hat and some mittens because I want him to be comfortable while we're out and sleepers are the most coziest items. I'm then going to lay out all the things that I need to pack in his changing bag. So I'm going to take his large muslin. Um, I need to also pack his wipes, his bottle, his nappy cream. Mm, some nappy ears, some burp cloths, and I think that's almost it. Ah, no, I need to make sure I also pack his cell machine in case he wakes up. That's something that always settles him. And his infocol and his dummies. So I'm going to put all of this into his changing bag and then get his car seat and get him ready to go. That's all in, so all that I need to do is pop him in his car seat. So we're gonna use the Nuna car seat today. Um, we're just gonna make sure he's situated nicely. Obviously he doesn't look very comfortable just yet, but he will do very shortly.
and we're off out. So I've put the sunshade down and it stops people from looking in, but it also helps keep the sun out of his face. And the first place we're going to go to is TK Maxx. So I'm just headed into the baby section now and there's lots to look at. I love those little silicon bowls and plates. They were nice. Um, I also liked these bibs, but I wasn't a fan of the the first one. I preferred the second one. And I saw the cutlery straight away, so obviously the cutlery had to come with me. So I'm just going to pop that in the basket. They also had um, like a variety of bibs, but some of them were just a little bit pricey. Um, and dummies, if you want cheap dummies, TK Maxx always have a good set of dummies um, going for cheap. So they just got a lot of Tommy Tippy in at the moment, but I don't need any of those ones. Uh, these are the bibs that I preferred and the ones that I do pick up. So I'm going to stick those in the cart. I liked those. And then I also looked at these, but I wasn't paying $9.99 for one. They also had a variety of shoes and socks. And for Easter, these little bunny slippers are the cutest thing. They had them in like a neutral color, pink and blue. And then obviously you have to look at the accessories. So like the socks and the hats. This was a Zara cap. And then the one behind it was a Hatley. I loved this towel set. I thought that print was so pretty, um, but I don't need it, so I'll put it back. And these blankets are also lovely. So they're like muslin on one side and fluffy on the other. Um, and they had one with bears on and one with um, little um, clouds. Obviously, this is my favorite place to buy accessories. And they had a ton of blankets. Um, which I think I might have to get her a blanket. I don't have one uh, specifically for her. All of my babies have a blanket specifically for them, but I've not picked up one for her yet. So that's something that I've got to do. And then they had toys and accessories here. So that's what I was looking for, was there any bits for her that she may need or want. And now we're going to head to the books because I love a good book and have a look and see what I can find. Now I've made some purchases, I am going to head to the next shop, which I think is Boots. And we're going to give you a quick peek at crew here he is sleeping like an angel perfect for me and let's take a look and see what boots has for us so they had a good sale on these toothbrushes it was like 20 percent off and i really liked that so those are the toothbrushes i picked up they've also got a variety of teething toys and dummies but I didn't see any new dummies I liked they had a ton of mam dummies I feel like our variety flops slightly in the UK um because we only really have like nook or um mam in the shops to choose from and then they also had a lot of sippy cups and bibs but I didn't need any of those but it was nice to have a little look at them to see what sort of things they had on offer they had lovely things
And the last shop I popped into was next. And these dresses were absolutely gorgeous. They also had the most prettiest pair of shorts that I have ever seen that I will probably show you soon. Um, there they are. Oh gosh, they're gorgeous with the little embroidered flowers on them. I absolutely love them. Uh, but it was quite busy in here. So I'm just avoiding people. I didn't want to film anybody. Like the cleaners were around. There was a lady with her kids. So I didn't want to film that. Um, but they had such a beautiful selection of clothes. Uh, the only thing that disappointed me was the girls' clothes are really much the same in next. I feel like I've been waiting forever for something new in the baby baby section. Uh, but they did have some really lovely sleepers. Uh, they were Easter themed, but I couldn't film them because they're too close to the cash register and I couldn't, I just couldn't bring myself to do it. But these ones were so sweet as well. The neutral ones. I absolutely love them. And they had a really nice little variety of neutrals. I would put either gender in all of these clothes. guys so me and crew are now back from the shops and he's just having a little nap in his car seat so whilst he's there if i tip him up a bit so we can see him a bit better i thought i'd do a little haul of everything that i got now most of this just for the new girl um because i wanted to be a bit prepared and get her some new little bits so um let's get straight into it so as you've seen in the um, video, I popped to TK Maxx next and boots, and I'm gonna show you everything that I got from there. So whilst I was in oh, boots, I'll do that first. I only got one thing. I got these toothbrushes, one for Lola for role play and uh, Lola, one for Lottie for role play and one for the new baby and they're just pink and there was a sale on in boots so I picked these up for quite cheap. I think they're about three pounds. And then in TK Maxx I picked up some bibs. Now the ones I was gonna pick up were um floral but I thought I'd give something a bit more neutral so I can use them with more and if I have boys I can use them with boys. So these are the bibs and they're by the brand Bumpkins and the soft bibs and they were $5.99 and they've got the little pouch but they're great because you can stick them in a changing bag so this one has the sun on it this one has this little rainbowish pattern and this one has a chevron like a chevron print sort of um, well triangles more than anything so i picked up those uh, i then picked up a um it's like a little pacifier um, holder thing and it's a little moon and it's by the brand, um, I'm not actually sure what that is because it's literally just a load of letters, uh, but it's a little moon and you can put the dummy on the end of it and I thought that was cute, that was nice and neutral. And then I also picked up by the same brand Bumpkins uh, some cutlery for her. I picked up the little silicon fork and spoon. So I thought they'd be nice for her and the sister. 
And then clothing wise, I picked up two things. So I picked up this Jules sleeper. Um, what size is this? This is a tiny baby sleeper and the pattern on it was so gorgeous. I loved it. So it's got a duck on it, uh, beavers, frogs, and it's really sweet. Um, and then the stripy feet. So I really liked that. So I did pick up that and I think crew will look beautiful in it. And then I also picked up this Hatley Baby Grow um, because I really liked, I love neutral tones, but when they get a bit bigger, it's just a bit more fun to dress them as something a bit bright. So this has little ice creams all on it and it's a pair of pajamas. So I thought this was really sweet. And this is uh, size six months, so, but it's not very big. So I just thought that'd be nice. And the last thing I picked up from, um, TK Max was this book and it says Babies London and then as you go through it it tells you the sites you can visit. I just thought this was really sweet and the people you can visit, so people you could meet, um, what you can explore, what you can travel by, uh, what things you can spot while you're in London, things you can eat while you're in London and then places to have fun. And I just thought this was a really cute little book and I love um, like an easy read for her. That just won't also be for those I have um, nieces. So, you know, that I know they'll enjoy that as well. And then from next, I picked up two outfits and I am obsessed with it. So the first one, you know, I like a good ribbed set. This is um, a sage green ribbed set and it's like a farm setting and it is so stinking cute. I absolutely love it. So I picked up the top and the leggings. Uh, what size did I pick these up in? So I did get these in nine to 12. Um, so they're a bit oversized for it, but they're so cute. They've got like little cows, sheep, hay bales, ducks, uh, puppies I love it so that's those with the ribbed leggings and then the second set of uh, leggings I picked up oh my god I'm absolutely obsessed with these uh, I picked these up in size six to nine months are these again sage green leggings with this little um <laughs> guinea pig on the knees and I picked that up because I used to have guinea pigs as a child and I absolutely loved them uh, and to go with that I did pick up just a simple white top uh, it's like a peplum style top and I thought that'd go really lovely with that outfit and it was really cheap so this top was £3.50 and the leggings for these uh, were £7 but what a sweet little outfit I'm really looking forward to putting her in that uh, but that is everything I picked up I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one thank you for watching bye guys